Marcy Gardner, St. Pete, Florida, um, and retired. Why are you here today? Because the thought of me, my daughter, my granddaughter, not, be, not being able to control what goes on with their body or they're allowed to make their own choices, just so upsetting. I feel like we're going backwards in time. I don't understand why people aren't, why people didn't know this was going to happen. I'm very angry uh, that people are saying, oh, but Gorsuch and Kavanaugh said that they were going to go with the, um, go with the precedent of the Constitution. No, sorry. All, everything, there was enough evidence to show that this is what was going to happen. And I'm just angry that we are at this point right now. What does your sign say and what do you mean? It says pro row. I'm not going to tell you whether or not to get an abortion. It is your own choice. It's your body, your choice. I'm not going to judge you if you do or don't. I'm not going to judge myself if I do or don't. I may not. I may not. Sorry, I'm old. I may not have chosen to have an abortion when I was younger, but that was my choice. And I want everybody to be able to have that choice. And the thing that gets me angry is when I was growing up, and I tell my husband this story all the time, my family was raised, oh, abortion is bad and all that sort of stuff. When we thought my sister was possibly, if there was a chance of her getting pregnant, my father came up to me and said, make sure she gets an abortion, which shows you how, how, for um, me and not for the, right, say, exactly, thank they'll, you. They'll do the loophole, but they won't, they don't want anybody else to do Exactly. Loophole, they want to do it for themselves, but oh, it's wrong, it's wrong, but I can do what I need to say it around the corner. And that's what got me so angry now, because I'm like, yes, I was raised that we probably could have taken care of it. But look at this. This isn't fair. It shouldn't be that way. Why are we going backwards? So that's where I stand. <laughs> and, and your name? Sarah Cabrera. I am an engineer from St. Petersburg, Florida. Um, and yeah. Oh, why are you here? Yeah, I am here. I'm here because I believe that it's a person's right to choose what happens to themselves. If they choose to have an abortion because it's not the right time for them, then it's not the right time for them. If they choose to have an abortion because something's wrong with the baby, say if they've got down, say there's something that they're misformed. There's certain things that it's like, you know, the life for that child is going to be way harder and maybe this isn't the right time to be having that child, but they should have the choice of saying, this isn't it. I want to do it again later, I want to do it on my own time, or I don't want to do it at all, but it's their choice to choose. And your name? I'm Tom, uh, retired also, uh, live in St. Pete. And I'm here because uh, abortions are still going to occur. And it's not going to be in controlled screen environments. They're going to be in back alleys with coat hangers and the things we heard about when we were kids. And, and young ladies are going to die. And that's, that's not right. Uh, whether or not, as, as a family, we would, we probably would never choose to make that choice. Uh, but that's our choice. Uh, not someone else. And the three of you are related? Yeah. These are my parents. 